What's happening, Captain? This your boy CB Hunts. And what you have before you is the Marvel Legends series, The Eternals, AJ. Man, she's the last figure that I had to get in this line. Last one I need of the bad guys is uh Koro. I'll probably I'll probably get him a little bit, a little bit later. But right now I got all the I got all the Eternals. So with Ajax, see how it looks in package, look quite nice. And we all seen that infamous interview that Selma Selma Hayek had talking about her figure, seeing how how her neck was kind of like ET. <laughs> so, but other than that, we gonna see for ourselves how she looks out of the box. But in package, looking quite nice. See the Eternals logo, got Ajax. Side of the box, got an image of Summer Hike with the Eternals E on the side. Back of the box, showing her full outfit, headdress, top. And you know, Ajax has a bio, so if you want to read it, pause it. Here it goes. But trust me, when we get back, we're going to have this bag out of the box and we will see what to do with uh, Ajax. Now we got this bag out the box. Man, I really do like this figure. I like the way the, the sculpt is made and everything else. And I kind of see what Selma Hayek was talking about with her neck. Instead of having her neck lean forward, they could have had it more like upward. Yeah. But we'll talk about more about that soon. We, soon we take a look at the figure. First, she wants to see what everything she comes with. And with Selma, she comes with extra pair of hands. She comes with fists right there. These are more of a open palm hands, like gesture hands she has right there. And she also comes with a extra head sculpt that she has, like a more regular head sculpt. And it, 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 it looks, it looks it's like it's like a like her a little bit. Without the makeup. So I kinda like the like head sculpt is, see if I can find a like a plain female body I could probably have this on because I think I've seen her in the trailers of her having uh, having on a a cowboy hat riding a horse so I'm trying to see if I can find uh body for this head and so now we're gonna talk about the main girl herself Ajax and you can see by the face, looks like exactly like Summer High. And I must say, the details of the costume with the Eternal figures are are damn near like like almost like perfect. They look quite nice. You see, that's a crown she has on her head. The design scope, each one is like they're like all like all original. I love that. That, 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 like, that royal blue and gold how it shines against the light looks fantastic love the design scopes of it looking quite nice gold gleaming like her part of her cape in the back see the like, gown and she also has type of leg designs as well you can see on her legs but nice as you can see also pinless Looking type of design there. She was a little bit different, a little plain, but love the design of it. It almost has like a, a old oil look, or like or like that like an old uh old plated look on the actual figure. I love the designs of her, her outfit up top. I still want to know where, where the e, each one is because I want to find out what, what all these are. But, but I know with some Hyde's character, she's the main one that talks to all the all the uh, celestials, the big, huge, like the 
the uh, the uh, big giants that you see walking around. She talks to all of them instead of everybody else. She's the main one who has the, these these elaborate talks, I guess. But we'll see more when the movie comes out. But with the figure here, kind of like the details of it, looking quite nice. Love the flow of the hair. See the back guy got little locks going on. See how it overlaps part of the hood coming through. As you can see. It's like a pin going through and going through the back. Got little highlights in the hair. It's looking quite nice. But so with Ajax here, we can go with her articulation. Can't really look she can look back. I'm surprised that she can look as far back as she can with her hair flowing like that. So that's probably why they did the actual neck because she can be able to look up. So I believe if she didn't have a neck joint like that, I don't think she'd be able to look up that way. But look down, got a huge head tilt as you can see. Arms go extremely high. Well, that one does. Yep, yeah, this one does too. A single elbow moving the wrist as hinge of the wrist as you can see here turn way around don't have an ab crunch but it does the upper upper torso waist so she can lean back that far crunch not too much at all good like a tilt with the legs can kick up this high as you can see kick back not too far because the gown kind of kind of blocks it a little bit she does has those double knees see you keep hitting the camera sorry about that you got double knees hit the foot and go down that far go up that much and does have ankle rocker all in all with Ajax with a figure we got all Eternals. Trust me, she is must have because she is the leader of the pack. And now we get a part of the review. We see how she looks next to some other MCU figures. The first one we got the bat is the Marvel Legends series Infinity Saga, uh, Endgame, uh, well, we'll say Armor Thor. I, I guess you can call it this is what's in game Thor I really do like this figure the articulation is crazy you get a chance to pick this figure up I'm hearing that now at Walmart they, they ha have more clearance I don't know because not, it's not at every Walmart but I'm just saying just, 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 just go check that out and next what you have to stack up with is the diamond select Marvel Select uh, MCU Thanos Armored Thanos I want to say I really do like this figure it looks I think out of all the Thanos even the Marvel Legend ones I think this one here is the better version but hopefully Diamond Select will make the unarmored version I hope they will make that one day now that I'll probably do a little, a little clip or image Hit him up on Instagram and, and also Twitter as well, saying we need a, a unarmored Thanos. You ain't lying. Well, I do. <laughs> <laughs> and last but not least, this I stack up next to the Marvel Legends. I think I forgot what what, what uh, wave this was in. It was a certain wave. Well, I think it was just the Walmart exclusive. Uh, worthy Captain America from the from the end game. Where you like this figure? I did make a custom shield for Cap and a custom Thor hammer with all the lighting. You see those? I did put them in a few other reviews. I don't know. I forgot which one I've used them in. But who knows? I might use that in certain pictures. I take on her. I don't know yet. Might might not. I don't know. And this is my review of the Marvel Legends series, Internals, Ajax. Hope y'all enjoyed this review. 
trust me, boy, had a fun time making it. And you know, with every review, I will take pictures. This is my Instagram right here, where I will leave links down below. We go and check those out. And your boy is on TikTok. Where I take those same pictures, I post over there, but I just add a little, little bit of flair. This is your boy, CB Hunts. Hope you have a blessed one. And trust me, I can't wait to catch you in that next one. Peace.